Welcome to Small Aid. Today we're making a slug mold and a lollipop mold at the same time. To do that, we'll be turning some aluminum stock and boring some aluminum tubing, as you can see over here. We'll be boring this tubing, which is 16 millimeter inner diameter, 20 millimeter outer diameter, into a final diameter of 17.1 millimeters, so it could match this. To do it in one go, I'll space it a bit so we can see the tip approaching. And the way to do that is I'm using a ground stock of tool steel which is fairly parallel put in there whoopsie okay the parallel is sitting flush and placing sorry about that I'm placing a bit of pressure here and I'm locking Don't forget to take this outside and it's not centered. There we go. Two things I'll have to set. My lathe stop. I'll move it out of the way now. There we go. I can see the tip of the bit. I'm locking. I'll verify rigidity. And lock. All the nuts very hard and I can actually start we're turning a very light taper which is understandable because this is a really long piece it's held by only something like 8 millimeters in the vise if you do it in two passes you'll never get a very smooth line and I'd prefer a smooth line consistent line even if tapered a bit and my measurements show roughly a 0 0.05 millimeters difference between both sides. So it's a difference I'm willing to take and do it in one go.
first let's adapt the late stop I want to make sure I won't bite into the jaws I've done it before and I didn't like the result okay the lay stop has been set we're safe to go I'll just touch off I'll just measure the touch off there we go we're at 9.5 that's acceptable This will be easily made into a lollipop mold by just using these two parts. All I have to do is oil the surface, lock it, it doesn't really lock but it holds nicely. And all I have to do is add some parchment paper so it will cover the entire surface over here and stick a lollipop stick. In order to make the slug I'll have a pin that is threaded like so and all I have to do is secure it all the bottom put some parchment paper there and pour some barley slugs but right now we're talking about lollipop molds so this is a fairly simple mold design I'll have to make a stand so the lollipop sticks protruding from the bottom will have somewhere to rest upon okay that's fairly easily done thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed it definitely too long too much time relatively to what I thought it would take but um, I think it was worth it we'll have to wait and see